Well, it's uh, of course the, always the start of the season and the end of the season. And the last one is uh, always great to be in Hockenheim. It's a tradition, you know, you have many people there. Uh, many times we had uh, close finals at the end, like last year, of course, uh, where it's really uh, you know tight for the championship and. Uh, Therefore, yeah, it's always good crowd. Yeah, the crowd is, is, is massive at that race. So finishing at Hockenheim is really, is really you know, a great circuit to, to finish at, you know. Um, and um, yeah, it's, I, I think I've won the last race of the season there as well with all the fireworks going off and stuff like that. But I've also got some pretty bad memories of the final at Hockenheim as well, one from last year, so. <laughs> and last year we had, uh, I was on pole and then this year I won the race. So. I, I really like the place. I like yeah, I like Hockenheim and I think it's the right place to have the last race of the season. The first part which is very fast, long straights and there's overtaken opportunities into the half into turn six. You need to be fast, that's always good. Uh, compromise between downforce and top speed and um, you need to be good on the brakes uh, for the happen. You still have to decide where you're going to be, whether you're going to go for performance in the last sector or you know, try and overtake. So that's, uh, there's still a bit of a, a compromise to be made with regards to setup at Hockenheim and that's always quite interesting because there can be quite big differences in straight line speed between cars sometimes. Hockenheim probably is one of the few circuits in the season where you can definitely now, since they introduced DRS and the option tires, you can overtake before allows the team to play with the strategy. I mean, we have seen in the first race of this year, different strategies, different results. And so there is a lot to play there. And I think, uh, as we have seen this year, the race has been very excited there. And hopefully at the end of the year, we're gonna give a nice show to, to the public again. It's very unpredictable. Uh, the track suits pretty much all the cars. And I think everybody has, has got a chance. It uh, would be great to finish the year seeing BMWs on podium and BMWs in front because it always gives you a good confidence through the winter to finish the, the season in a high. All three manufacturers have been very quick there. Um, I won there last year. Um, Augusta won there the first race this year. So I really think it's really, really difficult to, to say who's going to win there. Anybody can win the race and uh, of course if you would put money on and you are yourself involved and you have some self-confidence, you put it on yourself, I guess.